Hello everyone, my name is LP, um, I'll be, I'm a mother for two, and today I'll be playing through companionship. Um, as you might see, my graphics are in ridiculous amount, because I had some lag issues before. Um, that's hopefully all sorted out now. Um, I did a tiny part of this level, so I know this far, and that there's orange shell there, and that I have to use the cube there. But that's about everything I know. Whee! Over here, keep. Oh. Okay. This gave me orange gel. It is always fun to have orange gel. The main problem with orange gel, however, is that we often cannot paint this part. But that's not a problem. We still have a bit service here. And if there's one rule with like any gel, it's paint everything you can with that gel. I like no timers, because I just like time. So, we have a cube, and we probably have to do something with the cube, but we still have orange gel, so let's put out orange gel everywhere we can first. We have a face plate here, that looks dangerous. Mostly because it appears to be illegal. Um, we can, however, use that face plate to catapult cube into the funnel, and then use that funnel to get the cube against that, so something over there happens. It's not really clear what happens there, but it looks fun, I suppose. This one is also not... this is activated by... I think that's activated by that button. <laughs> Point for Gryffindor. So, how? Do I, yeah, we decided it was a good idea to put the cube over there. So let's do that first, and let's see. It actually is a good idea. Brilliant. Now, if only we put a pull over here and one over there. Then rush over here. Quick save, just for the sake of quick saving. Ah, okay, interesting. Now we need to get the onto that button. Cool. I like how we have to reuse this button over and over and over again. Um, okay.
I generally don't really like um, panels facing into your direction because you can get stuck and you can fizzle cubes with it, but nice puzzle. Um, cool, uh, let me restart the chamber real quick. Because you might argue, well, in this case it's not visible that there is a thing, but there it is visible because um, um, because of the color difference here, it's already visible that there is a thing there. And um, if I would have thrown down cube here, it could get fizzled. Yeah, or may, or something like this might happen. In that in that case, um, it looks like you have to do the whole thing again because you need to get over here again, and for that you need. To... Well, no, actually, that's not an. Yeah, that is the case because if you are here, um, you can have like a portal over here, but you have to go through this fizzler in order to get over here. So. In this case, you have to redo the entire chamber in case um, you fizzle that cube. It might be a bit mean, but yeah, other than that, it's a very nice map. Maybe it's easier to demonstrate over here. Um, let's throw down a few cubes. Yeah, uh, something like that. And then I have to press E. I hit plus. See, did you did you hear that? Uh, one of the cubes here got fizzled. And the other one didn't, but one of them did. So that can happen with panels and that I, I would recommend doing it the other way around, because it is possible to see that there is a panel in the first place anyway, so... Uh, uh, that was some annoying collision with smoke and stuff, but... Yeah. Uh, other than that, it's it's cool. Love it. And I like the fact that the map is called companionship and you have to bring your companion cube along all the time. It's pretty cool. And open! Is this actually also the button that opens the door? Yes it is. Okay, cool. Okay, well that's about everything I've got to say about it. So, um, thanks for creating.